Hello, in this video I will explain what kind of sensors we can simulate in Copeliasim VREP. In particular, I will explain how proximity sensors, vision sensors and force sensors work and what are their main properties. Copeliasim allows you to simulate proximity sensors to obtain the minimum distance between the robot and any detectable object in the scene. It implements up to six different types of detection volumes that allow you to simulate different types of sensors, such as ray type, typically used to simulate a laser sensor, or a cone type, typically used to simulate an ultrasound sensor. Detectable objects can be detected only even under certain type of sensors, which can be useful uh, under certain conditions. For instance, a whole effect sensor detects metallic objects, so you can set that a specific object is only detectable by inductive sensors and then uh, it cannot be detected with other type of sensors. Or for instance, in other cases, uh, crystals uh, objects should not reflect light from a laser sensor but can be detected with an ultrasound sensor. This can be set in each object in the detectable properties uh, dialog box. In addition to this, on each sensor we can set properties to define the sensor type, to adjust the detection volume and also some uh, detection parameters. Vision sensors allow you to simulate cameras that can be processed. You can obtain images from vis uh, visible and renderable objects. Vision sensors can be orthographic type, which indeed define a rectangular volume, or pers perspective type, which define a trapezoidal volume, as, as is shown in the figure. In addition to this, the camera view, either the original or the processed image, can be displayed on a floating view in a, uh, during a simulation, and this could be very useful. Vision camera processing can be uh, implemented using function callbacks. These are special type of uh, functions that will be called whenever we get a new uh, image uh, uh, using this sensor, but this is something we will see in a different video. Vision sensors can be used as standard RGB color cameras uh, or can be also used as 3D cameras, that is, they provide the depth or the distance to uh, the objects on the, uh, on the scene. The most relevant parameters on using, when using uh, uh, vision sensors are the field of view, which are indeed the near and the far clipping planes where the object is focused, as well as perspective angles and the ortho size. Also a very important parameter or property is the sensor resolution, which indeed defines the number of pixels of your image. Finally. Force sensors allow you to measure torque or forces uh, in the 3D axis, as, as is shown in the figure. They indeed act as links between two objects, so they, they, they make that the two objects are linked together, but this link is weak because it could be broken if the force that this sensor supports is higher than a given threshold. In this video, I explained sensors uh, that we can use in Copelisim. In the following videos, we will show how this sensor works. Thank you very much.